How are you? How are you? What babies? Come here. Thank you for the rose. Okay. Okay. <laughs> How are you? How are you? How's your holiday? What are you doing for New Year's? Nothing to be honest, just working and chilling and eating. Good, <laughs> Good morning. Good morning from rainy Orlando. Huh? Are you yeah. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Good morning from rainy Orlando. <laughs> like I'm a news a newscaster <laughs> or something. <laughs> Hi. I'm doing well, thank you. Where are you from, lady? I'm from California. Gosh. I'm tangled again. <sighs> this necklace is going to be the death of me one of these days. Aren't you precious? Well, thanks. Gee, thanks. <laughs> I look fabulous. Thank you. I appreciate that. I'm stuck with my ne I'm stuck in my necklace right now, so <laughs> just bear with me. I'm not trying to like creepily stare at the screen, it's just I have to use you as a mirror, so. <laughs> Thank you for the likes. That is extremely helpful. You love, love the jewelry? Thank you! I actually made the necklace out of three that I had broken. And now it continuously gives me trouble, so this one's probably gonna not work out too long either. Okay, there we go. There we are. Damn, you're looking beautiful this morning. Thomas from Nashville. Hello, Thomas from Nashville. How is your New Year's, pre New Year's going? Okay, Gabby, is Armando my soulmate? Is Armando Gabby's soulmate? You're manifesting your soulmate, but no, I don't feel like Armando is the one. But not in a bad way. I mean, like, he's not necessarily bad for you, but he is not the one that you are going to be eventually, like, actually with. my wife with another man right now. Hi, how are you? Um, is Jeffrey's wife with another man right now? No, she's not. Is Benny here? Is is Benny like somebody that had passed away? Good, how are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Is she coming back to me soon? Okay, so it's Jeff. Jeff, if you would like to do a, a love reading, we could do one. 
it's just five dollars for one question to the cash app three um three questions for ten dollars and twenty two dollars for a half hour um for jason is benny here i need I asked you a question about that, but I didn't see your answer if you did answer. We'll de-communicate with Rocky soon. Not, not soon, not, not what you consider soon. Excuse me, miss, but did you fall out of a salt shaker? Cause you be looking sodium fine, oh my god. <laughs> No. <laughs> that is the first time I've heard that one, though. He's your brother. Okay, but... But has he passed away? Is that... Like, are you asking... Spiritually, is he there? Or... Is, okay. Um, for that... I would have to do it in an actual reading. Um, but we can, if you'd like. Okay, so, these are the cards that came out for Benny. So I would say yes, he is. If you would like to do a reading. Jason, are you there? Mm -hmm. Thank you for the follow. Whoever's tapping the screen, thank you, I appreciate it so, so much. Do you think you could grab my, um, in, in the kitchen where the, in that basket, like where my stuff is from when I went to my mom's house, there's like, um, some, like, papers in a bag? that you'll see, like, right away. You think you could just grab the, the charts that are in the papers? The next card is going to be a heart. These aren't that type of card. <laughs> but, let's see. No, it's not. I just did look at it. It was this. Um, for a for a paid reading. Yeah. These are the only ones that are in there. In the yeah, right where these were. I mean, they might have been, but I just thought there was more. Thank you for the follow. If you if you had a free yes or no, then um, then you you next. I think I don't think anybody else is asking anything. But um, I'm going for a paid reading. Same. Is 
Jason's still in here. Do you accept Medicaid? <laughs> I do have payment plan options, yes. And I do also um, do financing. And I also do donated ones, depending on what the situation is. Or pay laters. And I'm pretty sure I might even accept Klarna. Hi, pretty girl. Good morning. Good morning, Michelle. How are you? Is that your getting ready for work? Fun. What kind of job do you have? <laughs> yeah, I was just looking at your profile picture to figure out what it was. It is a duck, huh? Cute. I just saw the funniest video of some little ducklings the other day, and they were all like rolling down a hill, <laughs> trying to learn how to run down it. Catch them, how cute. Thank you for the follow, Cricket. and Alberto reconcile romantically. Will Bernice and Alberto reconcile romantically? No. Will they reconcile? Good morning. You will reconcile, but not in a romantic way. At least not in the current path that you're on. But that can be, of course, change. How many wigs do I currently own? Mm, I think four. No, three. Three. How many am I wearing? None. <laughs> Good morning. Love my look. Thank you. Cheryl here. You're beautiful. Thank you, Cheryl. You're sweet. How are you today? Very pretty you are. Thank you. And thank you for the follow. If you guys could tap the screen, it would be so appreciated. Oh, is Rudy looking for Michelle? Is Rudy looking for Michelle? Was Rudy looking for Michelle? Will Rudy be looking for Michelle? No, no, yes. The cards today, let's do a collective reading for the people in the room right now and the viewers who view this. What is the collective? There is a rapid lifestyle change in your path. Looks like it has to do with overcoming a negative mindset towards money and your actual like missing the blessings that the universe is trying to give you because of that 
devil energy. So maybe it's like you're dealing with an addiction, maybe it's you're dealing with abuse, maybe you're dealing with just like the negative, like, you know, oh, I'm, I'm not able to make money, I can never do this, or um, I'm not good enough, you know, like, but either way, the universe has been trying to give you a blessing, you've been missing it because of your pessimism about what you'd have to give up for that blessing, and it is starting to be that time of your life where you have a rapid, quick paced change coming for you if you where you're going to be chasing your truth basically Am I going, is Michael going to be winning a talk wait have a winning talk about about year am I going to have a winning talk about year What's that? I don't, I don't know. Can you rephrase that question? I'm sorry. Um, Bianca, that would have to be in a actual private reading so that, because that's a serious question. I mean, like, they're all serious questions, but, like, that's a personal serious question. <laughs> I don't want to get it mixed up. You have a good day, Michelle, too. Is this year going to be a good for myself? Okay, so is this year going to be good for Michael? Is this year going to be good for Michael? Yes. It might start a little bit rocky, but... Thank you for the follow-up. the screen please everybody We're waiting for a settlement from the Navy oh well hopefully that gets sorted out soon for you well just trust it will be sorted out at the right time because sometimes if we got the money at a certain time then we would spend it in a way that wasn't for our best good so sometimes the universe makes us wait <coughs> Just like to say that you look great, but yet very beautiful. Thank you. Oh, over Camp Lugene, that's interesting. That I've seen so many ads like for that lawsuit. Fallen tree. Will I ever will fallen tree ever be truly in love? Yes. the sign of this person. And it will be most likely with somebody who has strong Virgo or Pisces in their chart. Wow, 450,000? Nice. What are you going to get? The house? Investments? Stocks? A reading with me? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Wendy would. Uh, does Omar stalk my IG because he has feelings for me? Does Omar stalk Joanna's IG because he has feelings for her? No. Does he stalk her IG? Are you sure he stalks your IG? Does Ernest see Molly as a wife? As his wife? Maybe our definitions of stalks are different. Um, and Molly, yes. Oh, well... I don't really consider that stuff. I consider, like, stalking on, like, Instagram would be, like, you know, like, every day checking your page, like, of all your pictures and, like, who comments on each of the pictures and, like, you know, like, not necessarily just watching the stories. So that might have 
misled that question. <laughs> Sorry about that. I love your name though, Cup of Wana. <laughs> My boyfriend's name is Wan. This is for my father who passed in 2018. Thank you for the roses. But I can't collect it. Oh, wow. And that's how he passed? Oh, I'm so sorry about that. Thank you for the roses and thank you for the likes. Appreciate that so, so much. What did Robert and Wendy last long? What, okay, so how do you consider long? <sighs> long time. Okay, but, but like, is that like more than a year? More than five years? Your entire lives? Going to court means the millions, 6.7, I'm talking about. Oh, so not going to court is the 450,000 and the going to court. Wow. Can I get a card? Yes, you may. Um, okay, so for a whole life. Yes. Hi. Will Rob ever tell? Ah, will Rob ever tell Allie how he feels? Yes. Robin. Hi, love. Hi. How are you, Joss? Robin. Robin, you've got some new income coming your way, or a new, um, like a new proposal, a new income, maybe a pregnancy, maybe, um, some big new reward, or start of something. Cleopatra! Who's Cleopatra? Thank you, you seem like you are in tune compared to a lot of the people on here, by the way. Oh, thank you, I appreciate that very much. It's always good to have feedback. Beautiful, thank you, you're welcome. Babies. Hello, baby kitty. Yeah. Hi, babies. What? Come here. Come here. Baby boy, yes you can. Very good. What it is? Why are you petting my hair? Come here. Come here. Get up. This is Simba. Was H's Instagram story meant for Charles? Was H's Instagram story meant for Charles? <laughs> Have any of the Instagram stories been meant for Charles? The one that you're talking about? No. But have there been ever any? Yes. Okay. 
you doing? I appreciate you. You're welcome. What are you doing, Santa? What are you doing? Hello, beautiful Ohio here. Where are you from? I am from California. What's Ohio like? Never been there. Cold and wet? <laughs> that doesn't sound fun. Are you struggling with a fearful or ungrounded feminine who might be giving up or you're giving up? Me up and I'll be your prisoner. Uh, no, I'm alright. <laughs> Cats are the best. I know they are, aren't they? Oh, I missed a question. Is John regretting not spending Christmas with me for a Is John regretting not spending Christmas with you? Yes. Can you read my future? Most certainly. Is Ryan the one for Tanya? Is Ryan the one for Tanya? No. No. No, but the, I feel like it's like um you're trying to You want the cat to tell you your future? Actually, he has his own little tiny mini tarot cards, but he never really liked it. He didn't really pick it up. But he does have little tiny mini ones. Let's see if I can find one. Oh. They're in here. Oh, wait, no, they aren't. But they're about this size. <laughs> and there are little cats on them. Where are they? Maybe they're in here. That's possum, right? Oh, yeah, there's one in here. somewhere and I don't remember where I put it but they actually have two decks because I have two cats so one of them has like a deck that looks like just like regular tarot cards and then the other one has a little kitty deck and this says in your future meow rawr rawr meow 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 that probably is something similar to what it does sound like him Good morning. I have Horace and I have Raya. Got them both. Obviously, raw on top, Horace. 
Я добиваюсь такие вещи. Да. And amber beads. Mm -hmm. Hello, hello. sweatshirt with the design on now. Awesome! Ironic, right? Or a coincidence? No, just kidding. Does Jose have Celia? Does Jose have to what? <laughs> I was like, am I missing it? Thank you for the follow. Does Jose have romantic feelings for me? Okay. So what's my thing? What do you mean? What What do you mean? What's my thing? Gypsy? I I have a gypsy soul. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Your son called himself the Phoenix? That's awesome. Yeah, I believe in um, living a life by the Phoenix concept, which is like where you will just, when things aren't working, you just kind of self-combust, and or any time that you take a really heavy fall, it's time to re-rise again. There's always a new version of you waiting for yourself to let it expand. Okay, so does Jose have romantic feelings for Cecil Cecilia? Does Jose have romantic feelings for Cecilia? Okay, it started out with a no and then it switched to yes, so I feel like he's still not like um, coming to terms with them or something. Like he's still resistant to it, but he does. And my thing would be, um, I... I think I was Egyptian in my past life. Um, I don't know, I have lots of things. <laughs> it's a good thing I have my library card because I'm totally checking out. You're welcome, Cecilia. I just found that I'm different from the humans, aka moral subjects, work ethics, so I can't relate. Ah. I do both, Kimmy? Or do I do questions on mediumship? I do both. Um, I'm doing free yes or no's right now um, for actual readings. You can have a mini read for $5, Cash App, Amber Energy Healer. You could do three questions for ten dollars, a half hour for twenty-two, and for mediumship it is fifty. For however long it takes. <laughs> oh yeah, so can can Dale trust the one that he loves? I'll trust the one that he loves. Mm. No. Um, I do also have Venmo and PayPal also, and a website that you can also pay on if that's the issue, if it's really just a cash app. Do I have any Organite in your crib? Yes, I do. Um, yeah, for, Ven for Venmo, it's the Phoenix concept, would be the name. And for PayPal, it's either Amber Energy Healer or Phoenix concept. 
I'm not sure which one, I can't remember, but. I have much to do. Well, me and Ventura reconnect in a good way next year at Mervyn's. Will Anna Beauty and Ventura reconnect in a good way next year? Yes. Hey, how are you? Two magnets, high power that switched polarity is way better. Interesting. You don't scare us, pal. Who doesn't scare you? Nine perfect strangers. Morning from Georgia. Morning. My work has just begun. Thank you again. I will be around. Okay, awesome. Have a good day at work. Why would my energy scare you? <laughs> Is it supposed to? Because you said, like, you don't scare us, pal. But who said I wanted to scare anybody? <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> She's a few as fuck. Thank you. <laughs> I'm like, if it's because of the skeleton thing, I mean, hey, man, we all have one. <laughs> <laughs> shouldn't be scary to anybody. <laughs> Just kidding. Where'd you go? Peaceful strangers? Or Percival? Perfect stranger? Percival? <laughs> she knows too much? But, so that's scary? I probably never hung out with females only mom you. Oh no. Let's see what's going on. What's going on, perfect stream? What's up? Maybe more intimidating? So you think I'm in, you think I'm intimidating? Is that what you're saying? Or are you saying that I'm not? I don't get it. I'm, I'm trying to get it, but... Does, like, this type of stuff scare you a little bit? Yeah, I'm going around spreading good vibes and positivity, so I hope you have a beautiful day. I hope you do, too. Thank you for those vibes and positivity. I don't think they were talking about you. I don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> you need help? With what, Johnny? I used to think I liked being dangerous. You do have a look of elegance. That's confusing. Why is that confusing? <laughs> You found out that kindness is far more difficult than being dangerous? Oh yes, very true. Hey girl, how are you? I'm doing well, thank you. How are you? Yes, can you send over there? Yes. We'll 
to it. I don't know what that means. What energy do I feel that you give out to me? Um, real fast, Kimmy. Is there any, like, significance to the month of May or, um, Nove November? You look very nice. Thank you. I hope I am. <laughs> Is Mary with another guy? Is Joe's Mary with another guy? No. November? Okay, specifically... Specifically the 3rd through 12th? I think it was the 3rd through 12th. I mean, it could have been the 13th through 22nd, but I'm pretty sure it's the first one. Oh, it was the second one? Okay. I work on, like, a very... I mean, it's, like, they're very small pizza lines, so sometimes I get one over. <laughs> a real one, few and far between. Mm -hmm. Enjoy the day, humans. Thank you, you too. Um, Tony, what did you, you wanted to know what energy you give off, right? Read my form, what form? I have a form. I got my website. Um, dangerous coming, what's dangerous coming? Tony, I feel like you are somebody who wants to start, um, like, a fresh path or a fresh journey, but you're really pessimistic about what you might have to give up along to do that. It may have to do with a partnership, but there is definitely some truths coming out to you recently about what has been causing your major disappointments. know what you read. I'm not, thank you for the follow, I'm not too sure what the sentences mean, Johnny. <laughs> Can you write like in a full sentence? Because I'm getting kind of confused with those. <laughs> you heard him, Simba? I know, my baby. Watch the see if he'll sing. Simba! Thank you for the follow. Johnny, I don't know what those... Okay. You're using like half sentences here. <laughs> so if you could talk in a full sentence, it would be really helpful because I don't know what you mean and it's gonna start. Amber Badger, nice name. I remember energy. Say something. Is Simba my only kitty? No, I have Simba and I have Monster. Monster is a little black one. Am I doing free readings? I'm doing um, free yes or no's. And then $5 mini reads. Jenny get the job. Will Jenny get the job that she wants to get? Uh, not that I don't believe so for the current one, no. 
But as with anything for the future, it can be changed thanks to free will. But in the current path that you are currently on, um, it looks like it's enough. If you'd like to know what you could do to help persuade it, then we could do a mini reading on that. Will um, Z Money be in a serious relationship in 2024? Thank you for the likes. Yes. You don't know what you read. That's what you've been trying to say, Johnny? No, I could not read what you were writing. <laughs> Is Fabian into Jocelyn? Is he just playing? Or... Yes, he's actually into. Well, DJ and Jenny. Wait, is that Jenny or Jen? Okay, well, DJ and Jen get married. No. Um. Yes, for Z Money. Yes. Good morning. Rise, fall, and rise again. That's the phoenix concept. As many times as you need to. <sighs> Dangerous coming. Okay, Johnny. Are you trying to get a reading, Johnny? <laughs> is that what this is? I feel like you're trying to get a reading. You probably don't want to pay for a reading. So you're probably trying to see what I end up saying or doing or whatever. But if you're trying to get blocked or something like ridiculous like that, I don't do that in here. <laughs> so if you are trying to get attention, then you've got my attention. You've got the floor, so start talking. Jail? J okay, did I say that wrong? Jail? 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 Good morning! Yeah, Johnny wants a reading. Will Jail's disability get approved? Yes. Will it get approved this... Oh, Heil. Oh, okay. Hi, y'all. Sorry about that. Um, well, hi, y'all's disability get approved. Okay, I'm still getting a yes, but is it going to be this first time around? Like, will it get approved right away? Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> Thank you for the follows. Thank you for the likes. Johnny, are you by um, any chance bipolar? Thank you for the follow. Or just very imbalanced right now. Hope you're having a good morning. I'm new here. Well, hello, new here. How what are you doing today? Is Don interested in Phil? Is Don going to be interested in Phil? Okay, so at the current moment, I'm getting a no, but in the future, I am getting a yes. Is Matt missing Ash? 
Hazmat missed Ash. In the current moment, no. In the has he missed you? Yes. So it could be like maybe he's sleeping right now, so he doesn't realize he's missing you. But like um, in this current current moment, it's a no. But he has yes. Read the card about me. I bet you sing really pretty, don't you? <laughs> I've been trying to teach myself how, actually. Yes, you may ask me a question. Will I answer? Maybe. <laughs> you can ask it. What's going on with Greg and me? He walked out on me on Christmas Day. Ooh, tower moment. Okay, so this is for you and Greg. It looks like there was a tower moment, and that is what led to the separation. It had to do with feeling like impatient and like, um, kind of like overwhelmed with the amount of work or like the um like the frustration and like the impatience with the actual work itself um that he's been putting in or that he has he thinks that he's been putting in like basically the relationship might have gotten like exhausting like um and he just it just led to a tower moment i see you have a hello baby <laughs> I see you have a pendulum that you use cards. Do you have any other tools that you use? Um, charts with my pendulum. Uh, I do get like downloads. Um, not really other than that. I mean, other than like candles and stuff, but. <laughs> oh, and then like for like Reiki and things like that, then yeah, of course. I have a lot of stuff for that. But as far as for readings go, no. Jimmy's saying he needs more love <laughs> immediately, yeah. Come here. Come here. I have my fiance because oops. Oh, where'd it go? I have my fiance recovering from accident. We have been extremely close, but he swears we are good. Well, let's do a reading if you'd like. Um, I feel like dream analysis would be great for you. Have you ever tried scribing? Okay, so actually, um, I do like to do dream analysis stuff because I do get, um, like, visions or, like, dreams that, like, premonitionary dreams, I guess. Um, but as far as scribing goes, I do, I have, actually, I have a couple of videos on my page about it. Like, um, every once in a while, I channel ancient Phoenician writing <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's ancient Phoenician. It's like the, it's an ancient Semitic or s There's like three videos on my page though about it. If you'd like to check them out, they're down towards the bottom. One of them looks like it's red or something. Good morning. I know that's why I'm saying it. Oh, <laughs> I've never crossed your page before, but. That was the first thing. Oh, cool. 
Johnny, you want to give me a reading now? Sure. If I give you my name and day of birth, will you give me a read? Um, you don't need to do the date of birth thing. Um, if you'd like to do a mini reading, though, yeah, if you'd like to send it to the Cash App Amber Energy Healer or Venmo the Phoenix Concept. Randizing, I just join your eyes are magnetic and alluring. Thank you. I would love a reading. It'd be it so difficult. Or different. I'm supposed to go home with him and start a life, but Hi Cheryl. Anyways, I'm about to jump off, but I am starting something wonderful and new to TikTok. I've only... Oh my gosh, you're so beautiful. Thank you. Hi, beautiful. Hi. I've been on a few days... Oh, a few months, but I'm shopping for good readers for what I'm trying to put together. Oh, awesome. I will give you a follow. Johnny seems to be trying to warn you stuff about something this whole time. It's kind of creeping me out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm still trying to figure out what he's trying to say, too. I did see that, um... Okay, yeah, Mystic. I got an eye of Horus. I've been trying to figure out my ancestors and my journeys for years now. Oh, I went through that, like, what was that, a year ago or two years ago? Two years ago? I got on a whole ancestry kick because <laughs> I started seeing, like, past life memories and um, they weren't matching with, like, what my family was telling me my ancestry was. And so um, I did a DNA test and I was right. <laughs> That's so funny, huh? <laughs> <laughs> like, literally, my family was, like, telling me that I was crazy, basically. Like, you're not from there. But I was right. <laughs> Greetings. <laughs> that was about the point that they stopped, like, being resistant, huh? <laughs> oh, thank you for the snowman! King of New Jersey, does should King of New Jersey wait for fate? No. You're very beautiful. Thank you. For anybody who's in here that's interested in booking or reading um, at any other time in the future, you can go to amberenergyhealer.com. You can also, if you want to do like a test run, you could go to my YouTube under the same name, Amber Energy Healer and Tarot. And um, on there I have two playlists. There's a tarot reading and a tarot pick a card reading. Um, both of them are timeless and collective and you can just click on whatever video is calling out to you and whatever pile is calling out to you and that would be the message that you need to hear in that moment. doing readings right now, like mini readings, and um, for one for t five, three for ten, and twenty-two for a half hour. 
King of uh, New Jersey. It looks like religious factors might be what's getting in the way with your... Oh, that's interesting. Her name is Faith. You know what? King of New Jersey, if you're in here still, are you in here still? Have you guys not been doing very much? Like, have you been, like, doing a lot of things with her for the holiday? Are you? Okay, so if you're wanting things to work out, you need to turn that around. Um, because I am getting that there, you should enjoy the bliss of holiday time together and you attract romantic love by enjoying the moment fully. And your love life is being influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. So I feel like you both are not necessarily wanting things to, um, split apart, but you need to, she's married. Okay. Well, that would definitely be an, a factor. It's really important, though, that you... You need to look at it from a perspective that you are making yourself actually happy. So, if you're able to be spending time with her, then make sure it's in the highest of light. Especially if she's in a broken marriage that she's probably trying to get out of, I'm sure. Like, And you're arguing with her a lot, that makes it a very un unstable, like, she's not going to want to leave then if the person that she's leaving for is arguing with her a lot, right? So I would really, if I was you, I would reflect inwardly, like, very, very deeply and see if it's even something that, like, if you guys were to, like, if she was like, oh, I'm divorced now, we're together, would you be fully invested and fully able to trust her and fully happy or not? And if it's a no, if there's question about it at all, or if there's anything like that, then I would say to just let it transition out or to just live your life in the way that makes you happy and not sit around waiting for somebody who isn't sitting around waiting for you. Does that make sense? And once you're in your happiest state, she'll either flow to you naturally or somebody more suited for you is going to be able to meet you at your level. Okay, um, Alex, what would you like to... How much did you send? I can't check it right now, so I'm just going off of the trust system. So <laughs> how much did you send? And... Um, so I know. Okay, cool. So what would you like to ask? Thank you for the follow. girl I like is emotionally unavailable. Should I stop talking to her? The girl Alex. What's her first first name or a nickname that you could nickname her? Oh. Chelsea, okay. Okay, so it looks like, um, there's a few things that are 
affecting her, which is then obviously translating to you. She's got some family issues she needs to heal. There's also some issues with like finances, um, or maybe like a career, and she's fearful of codependency. But also, I am seeing unrequited love for you and her, um, where there's not enough like attraction or chemistry to actually keep the relationship going. So I feel like what is keeping you in the loop right now with her is that she is unattainable. Like she is emotionally unavailable. So it keeps you chasing kind of, or wanting, you know, um, if she was to become fully emotionally available, I don't feel like she's going to be enough to keep you happy, honestly. Um, let's see what Alex's feelings for Chelsea. Yeah, you're hoping things will rebirth. You're ready to put it to the past, but Chelsea's feelings for Alex. Chelsea's true feelings for Alex. She feels like there's a lot of um, extra work going into things. Um, she feels like either you're very slow moving or she's very slow moving. Like, like she feels like it's going to be like a very like slow... Like she feels like she's at a standstill with you. Like she feels like... Um, you're insightful and I'd like to know how to talk more with you. Um, yeah, on my website, amberenergyhealer.com, you could, um, go to the booking services, I believe, and then, um, there's lots of options, or you could go to premium.chat forward slash amberenergyhealer, and then on there, it calls me directly on my phone for any of the options. Yes, it does. Can you explain, please, what codependency is and why someone fears it? Okay, so codependency is, like, when somebody is needing to, like, stay, um, like, enmeshed or, like, connected with somebody. Like, um, like, past the point of just wanting to spend time with somebody, but, like, actually, like, you are dependent on the person, um, like, emotionally and financially and physically and, you know, like, um, where you're literally, like, reliant on them to be able to function. You have amazing presence. Thank you. You're very welcome. So for Alex... Alex, um, at the bottom of the deck, I am getting the card for walking away from the emotional... I think it's... I think it's probably, um in your best interest to not stay waiting and for you to pursue your passions like a new passion project instead um, because because it's gonna either a bring light to what like is being currently hidden emotionally, or B, it's going to actually wake her up to what she's losing, essentially, you know? I wouldn't say do it in, like, a mean way, but, like, do it in a way where she knows why it's happening, it's because she's not emotionally connecting with you the right way, and that you're willing to work on it, you know, and you're willing to, um, you want to have the relationship but you can't be depriving yourself at the same time and that's why you're leaving so that she knows what she needs to be fit like you know sometimes people don't realize what they're doing or what they're not doing you know prestige worldwide what's that yeah she needs to heal yeah i should it's in my mind to just let it be thank you for the follow Um, for anybody that's wanting to ask questions, you do uh, five dollars to Ember Energy Healer on Cash App or Venmo the Phoenix Concept. Good morning, Trina. How are you? I'm 
doing well. Thank you. I appreciate your patience and presence. Thank you. Hello, hello. Hanging out with my goat. <laughs> All right. <laughs> How old is your goat? Hello there, how are you? How's your morning? Just vibing? How long is a year and a half? Is it a big one or a mini one? I was wanting a mini one so bad before. They're the darndest, cutest things. Oh, and fainting goats are so cute. Does Lerda regret moving on with the puppy? She's bigger than you, no way. How big can goats get? <laughs> you mystify me. Thanks. I think Simba needs treats. Simba does have treats. He was singing a song earlier. It was so cute. He's getting so good at it. She's part Ibex. I have no idea what that is. Is that a wedding ring? It is... Not a wedding ring, it's an engagement ring. Well, it's two engagement rings. I, I told my, um, my boyfriend that he had to get me one for each of my personalities. <laughs> so I knew he was taking the whole package. <laughs> Oh, oh, I know what you're talking about. Do they have long hair? They're like kind of shaggy looking, I think, right? Hi. I think I know what you're talking about. Is it inside? Or do you, are you outside? I've got so many questions now. Oh, that's so cool. Hey, how are you? TikTok Dave. <laughs> She's inside, how cute. Phoenix is actually my last name. Really? That's that's pretty awesome. Hello, Coach Allen. How have you been? Thank you for the follow. Great, just getting my workout in. Awesome. Hey, you know what? Um, remember? Uh, well, you probably, I don't know if you remember, but remember in, in my hypnosis when I saw the um, the striped shirt kid, the little kid. I, it was my son. <laughs> I found a picture of him that was taken when I didn't have him, and um, he's wearing that shirt. It's like that exact. Just a fun fact, in case you're wondering. <laughs> oh, she's your familiar? Oh, that's awesome. Thank you for the follow. Hey, new here. How's it going? 
Thanks for stopping in. Welcome to my dream. <laughs> Say something, I'm giving up on you. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I couldn't get to you. Anywhere I would have followed you. Say something, I'm giving up on you. <laughs> Am I doing readings? Yes. Um, for $5 mini readings to cash out. Amber Energy Healer or Venmo the Phoenix Concept. But if you send something, you do have to let me know that you sent it because... Also oh, sweet. I love you singing to your cat. <laughs> I love his voice when he sings back. He duets with me. This is Simba. He's my biggest baby. Monster's the little baby, but I don't know where he's at. Let's sing more to him. <laughs> That's his second favorite song. His first favorite song is the Little Mermaid song. That was like his very first favorite song. Hi, baby. You wanna go night nights? You ready for bed? <laughs> I wanna be where the people are. I wanna see, I wanna see them dancing. <laughs> Walking around on the what is it called again? <laughs> it's about to melt. Yep, there we go. <laughs> Feet. Flipping their fins, you don't get too far. Legs are required for jumping, dancing. Strolling along down the street. You kind of look similar to mine? Well, then it's probably an awesome cat. <laughs> Up where they walk. <laughs> He's such a baby. <laughs> Up where they run. <laughs> He's trying to go night night, kitty. He's sleeping. Okay, but I'm gonna log off so I can let this little baby here go to sleep. Oh my gosh, I love him. I know, right? So many past relationships, some good, some bad. How do you know if you're in the right one? I would say do as much shadow work as you can regarding the past ones. See if you can find any spots in your current one that you are ever comparing or fearful of something because of somebody from previous. And if there's any yeses in those categories, then focus on those points. And then try to look at your relationship from the perspective of if nothing changed between you except for on your part. Like if you were the only one that did any changing and the other person was not gonna change at all, would you be happy 10 years from now looking back? If it was another 10 years, the way that the other person acts doesn't change. And then you'll have your answer. <laughs> I 
Another way would be to ask your partner what their goals are in five or ten years and see if you guys even have the same goals. I feel like I have to change, but I've put more effort in this time around. And, you know, sometimes... The only thing that... There shouldn't really be, like, a comparison of, like, who's put in more effort, but, well, there shouldn't really be, like, a comparison at all, except for with your past self. So, like, because you guys are both individual people, right? And, like, if one person, unless, of course, it's, like, a stipulation, like, if they're saying, like, you need to do this work, and then they're not doing the work, then I could see that being a comparison. But if you're just choosing to do the work because you want to better the relationship, then just see it as that. Just leave it as a gift for the relationship rather than something that is um, going to be compared. Unless, of course, it was agreed upon that you're both going to do work on it. Because otherwise you might be building up, like, accidental disappointment for yourself. That doesn't necessarily need to be there. Because it could be seen as, like, just like a, you know, a positive thing about your commitment and your ability to heal and to put work in, right? And then, like, instead it will be seen as a negative because you're seeing it as, like, I'm the only one that did the work. You get what I mean? So it kind of, like, reverses something that could be really positive in your mind to something that might be led by disappointment. Both of us have put more effort in this time around. We took a break a year ago. Okay, so, so that's really good if you both are doing more. That's a very positive thing. <laughs> no, he wasn't in the troops. Oh, there he went. Is he eating? I'm getting water. Oh, he's over his food and water. Wow, morning from Minnesota. Good morning. Okay, but yeah, I'm going to be logging off right now. Um, I'll probably be on later. Go to amberenergyhealer.com if you'd like to check out any services that you could be booking. Um, check out premium.chat forward slash amberenergyhealer if you'd like to call me directly. And um, check out my YouTube and my videos on here if you'd like to just see what types of readings and stuff I do. Okay. Love and night. Have a great day. You're welcome.